chapter 3 example 3.5 find the condition that the roots of the cubic equation x cube plus a x square plus b x plus c is equal to 0 are in the ratio p is to q is to r so the given roots are ratio the given roots are ratio this one only important of this sum solution since the roots are the roots are ratio so p is to q is to r since the given roots are ratio so we can assume we can assume the roots are p lambda q lambda r lambda so the normal value this one the ratio value this one the normal value first to find the value of summation 1 so summation 1 that is equal to the first one p lambda plus q lambda plus r lambda so that is equal to is equal to the given equations is x cube plus a x square plus b x plus c is equal to 0 so this one the place of this one 1 a b c so that means minus a divided by 1 is equal to minus a that is lambda 1 so next to find the value of lambda 2 lambda 2 is equal to p lambda plus q p lambda into q lambda the first term next one plus next one q lambda into r lambda next one plus r lambda into p lambda is equal to p by 1 is equal to p ok the next one summation 3 summation 3 is equal to p lambda into q lambda into r lambda so that is equal to is equal to the value of this one minus c so this equation number 1 this equation number 2 by using this two equation only equation number 1 which implies equation number 1 which implies p lambda plus q lambda plus r lambda is equal to minus a the common value is lambda the remaining value is yes. the common value of lambda in outset p plus q plus r is equal to minus a next lambda that is equal to minus a divided by p plus q plus r this one the first lambda value next one equation number 3 equation number 3 consider that means p lambda into q lambda r lambda is equal to minus c so next one lambda 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 cube into p q r is equal to minus c next one lambda cube is equal to minus c divided by p q r so lambda is equal to minus a divided by so equation number 4 equation number 3 consider that equation by 3 is substituting the value of this one so equation number 3 in equation number 4 equation number 4 this one equation number 4 let us consider equation number 4 so minus a divided by a plus minus a divided by p plus q plus r so is equal to the whole power 3 is equal to minus c divided by p q r so this one minus a cube minus a cube into p q r that is equal to this one p plus q plus r the whole power 3 into c minus so minus minus cancel which is required conditions is a power 3 into p q r is equal to p plus q plus r the whole power 3 into c 
that is a required condition of the given sum the next one example 3.7 3.6 tani is a separate video so if p is a real if, if p is real discussed of the natural roots of the equation a 4x power 2 next one 4px plus p plus 2 is equal to 0 in terms of p let us consider p value so the first one the given equation so given that 4x power 2 4px p plus 2 is equal to 0 p plus 2 is equal to 0 the next one we know that the result of delta is equal to b square minus 4ac b square minus 4ac here the given value a is equal to 4 b is equal to 4 p q c is equal to p plus 2 this is the given value so let us check the lambda delta is equal to b square b square is equal to 4 p the whole square minus 4 into a value a means 4 next c c means p plus 2 so that is equal to this one 16 p square 16 p square next one minus 16 into p plus 2 is equal to 16 p square minus this one inside multiplication 16 p next to minus of 32 32 so that is equal to 0 is equal to 0 which implies 16 p square 16 p minus 32 is equal to 0 so by divide in 16 p square minus p minus 2 is equal to 0 so multiplication 2 addition minus 1 1 2 so this one minus p plus 1 into p minus 2 is equal to 0 then P is equal to minus one. P is equal to two. So the number line is the number line is minus infinity to plus infinity. Let us consider the center place zero. So minus one. This one minus one. This one two. So this equation exists for the area. So for this area, the in between of minus one to minus minus one to two is a imaginary imaginary. imaginary the particular area of the minus 1 no next one plus 2 is equal is equal the less than of this area next to greater than of this area is distinct that's all the result so let us convey the result of first one delta greater than 0 so the first one delta greater than 0 Again, get delta less than zero. Let us cancel the value of delta less than zero if imaginary. Delta less than zero is imaginary. The condition C is minus one is less than P is less than two. That is the condition. The next one, second part, delta is equal to zero if this one. real and equal real and equal so p is equal to minus 1 or p is equal to 2 p is equal to minus 1 or p is equal to 2 the last result third one delta is greater than 0 if <coughs> distinct result distinct so the value of this one Minus infinity less than p is less than minus one. O R. Next one is two less than p is less than infinity. This is the distinct result. The three results is available. P is equal to p value. The first one is less than zero is imaginary. P is equal to zero real and equal. The last one greater than zero. The distinct element. That is called discuss about the natural roots of the equation for the given sum.